Hello everyone, in this video we will discuss about BCD to decimal decoder. Our aim is to design a BCD to decimal decoder with unused combinations of BCD code as don't care. So this is the block diagram. Here there are 4 inputs A, B, C and D and there are 10 outputs that is from D0, D1 etc up to D9. Usually in a decoder if there are n number of inputs then the output will be equal to 2 raised to n but in some cases it can be less than 2 raised to n and this is one such case. So in BCD we can represent decimal digits from 0 to 9 and 10 to 15 is invalid in BCD. So here there are 6 don't care conditions. So instead of 16 outputs there are only 10 outputs in a BCD to decimal decoder. This is the truth table. So in the input section we have written the BCD corresponding to decimal digits 0 to 9 BCD codes corresponding to decimal digit 0 to 9 and we have written the outputs also here we have considered the decoder to be having active high output so corresponding to the input BCD combination the output will be high and all other outputs will be low so corresponding to 0000, 0, 0, 0, D0 will be high and all other outputs will be zeros. And corresponding to 0001, 0, 0, 0, D1 will be high and all other outputs will be zero. Similarly, up to D9, so uh, similarly up to 9, so 1001, 1, D9 will be high and all other outputs will be zeros. So this is the truth table. Now we have to find the simplified expression for each output. For that we can draw the K-map. Since there are 10 outputs over here, we have to draw 10 k maps but it is a time consuming process so instead of drawing 10 k maps we can draw a single k map and we can find the simplified expression for each output from the single k map itself so we will see how to do that now we'll draw the k map So I am going to write AB over here and CD over here. So this is 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0. This is A bar, B bar, A bar, B, A, B, A, B bar. This is C bar, D bar, C bar, D, C, D bar and C, D. Now, if you look upon the truth table, we can see that corresponding to A0, B0, C0 and D0, the output D0 is high and all the other outputs are zeros. That is corresponding to 0, 0, 0, 1, it is 0, corresponding to 0, 0, 1, 0, it is 0, etc. up to 1, 0, 0, 1, it is 0 and the combinations from 10 to 15 will be down cash. So here there is only zero uh, here only for corresponding to d0 only uh, the combination 0000 is having the output high so we can write corresponding to 0000 it it has the output as d0 so instead of 1 i am writing here it as d0 all the other outputs will be zeros so this will be 1 and all the other outputs will be zeros corresponding to d0 and there will be six down care conditions also in this k map now we will check the next condition that is corresponding to 0, 0, 0, 0001 corresponding to 0, 0, 0, 0001 we can see that if uh, we can see that we are taking d1 so corresponding to 0, 0, 0, 0001 it is high d1 is high and for all other cases d1 is 0 so we can write for 0, 0, 0, 0001 that is for this cell D1 is high and for all other cells will be zeros and there will be down case also. So similarly we can write for D2, this is 2. So if I am writing the cell numbers over here, 0, 1, 2, 3, this is 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 and 15 because I have taken AB here and CD here. So the cell number uh, numbering will be like this. So this corresponds to D0, this corresponds to D1. This is D2. Now if we take upon the combination 0011, 
zero zero v one one it is d three. We will be drawing the k map for d three. Then for zero zero one one only d three is high and all other outputs will be zero. So we will write d three over here. Next, if we take zero one zero zero, it will be d four. This will be d five, d six, d seven, d eight, d nine. Now from ten to fifteen, it is the down care condition. So we will be marking down care over here. Now we can write the expression for output. So first we'll take d zero. So here we can see that if we here we can see that if we take the k map for d zero, only this cell will be one, and these cells will be zeros, and this will be the down case. So as you can see over here, if we take d zero, only zero 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 one cell will be one, and all other cells will be zeros. So I can't group this one with any other one or any down care over here, so I will keep it as I will keep D zero as it is. So the expression for D zero will be equal to A bar, B bar, C bar, D bar. If there is any confusion, we can draw the K map for D zero and verify. So the K map for D zero will be like this. So if this is the K map for D zero, this is A B and this is C D. Zero zero. So corresponding to D zero, only zero 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 cell is high, and all other cells are zeros. So this is high, and these all are zeros, and these are down care conditions. So we can't map this, group this one with any other one or any down care. So the expression for D zero will be equal to A bar, B bar, C bar, D bar. I hope now it's clear. Now let us check upon the expression for D one. So if you check upon the expression for D one, then D one will be high, and all other cells will be zeros, and there will be down case. So we can't map D one with any other cell. We can't map this one with any other cell. So we will keep D one as it is. So D one will be like this, D zero will be like this. So I can write D one as A bar, B bar, C bar, D. Now next is the expression for D two. So D two can't be mapped. We can map D two. So here D two can be mapped with this cell. So I'll show that. If we take D two, we can map D two with this down care. So that is. D two can be mapped like this. So the expression for D two will be here for the first and last column. B bar is common, so we can write B bar, and here it is C D. So we can write the expression for D two as B bar C D. Now, if we want to draw the K map for D two, we can draw that. So the K map for D two will be like this. So only D two will be high, and all the cells will be zeros, and this will be down case. So we can map this one with this down cap. So we can form a uh, we can form a pair. So the expression will be this is zero and this is zero. Zero is common here, so it is B bar. This is C and this is D bar. So the expression is B bar C. It is not D. It is D bar. B bar C D bar. So here I have written as there is a mistake over here. I have written here as C D bar and this is C D. It is not like that. It is C D and this is C D bar. So that is the expression for D two. Now if we look upon the expression for D three, this D three can be mapped with this down care. So the expression for D three will be equal to here. This is the first and the last column. So B bar is common. 
So D3 can be written as B bar C D. Now we will look upon the expression for D4. So this is D3. Now D4 will be mapped like this. D4, this one can be mapped with this down care. So the expression for D4 is here B is common. B, C bar, D bar. Next the expression for D5. D5 is we can map D5 with this down care. So it is B, C bar, D. Next is D6. So D6 can be group with this down care. So the expression for D6 will be B, C, D bar. Now next is the expression for D7. So D7 will be, we can do the mapping like this. So it is B, C, D. Now next is D8. So here, in the case of D8, there is a down care over here. And also two down cares over here. So we can group it as a quad. So the expression for D8 will be here A is common in the third and fourth column A is common and if we look upon the first and the last row D bar is common so it is A D bar. So if you if you need you can draw the uh, K map for D8 and verify. So I am going to draw the K map for D8. So D8 here, so if we look upon D8, we can see that 1000 zero, zero, zero is high and all other uh, uh, cells are zeros. So 1000 zero, zero, zero is high, this is high. And all other cells are zeros. These are all zeros and from 10, 10 to 15, it is down care. So we can do the grouping like this. This one can be combined with this down case. So the expression becomes A D bar. So that is the K map for D8. Now we will see the expression for D9. So D9 is equal to this D9 can be combined with this one. One in the uh, place of D9 can be combined with this three down case. So we will get the expression as. Here A is common in the third and fourth column A is common and in the second and third row this D is common so we can write it as A D. So we have got the simplified expressions for all the outputs from the single K map itself. So these are the expressions for D0 to D9. Now we, now we can implement this using logic gates. So let us see the uh, see the simplification uh, see the implementation using logic gates. So if this is a, this is a bar, b, b bar, c, this is c bar, d, and this is d bar. So d zero is equal to a bar, b bar, c bar, d bar. So we can write, so we can draw D0 as A bar, B bar, C bar and D bar. So we can give this to a AND gate. So this will be D0 which is equal to A bar, B bar, C bar, D bar. Now D1 is A bar, B bar, C bar, D. A bar, B bar, C bar, D. So this will be D1, A bar, B bar, C bar, D. So we can draw up to D9. So that is the implementation using logic gates. So this uh, gate realization 
will be coming in this box this logic circuit will be coming in this box so that is the so the input is a b c d and the output is d0 d1 d2 to d9 so the logic circuit which we have got now will be coming inside this so that's the design of a vcd to decimal decoder with unused combinations as don't care that's all for this video thank you